three astronauts who completed China's longest manned space mission returned to Earth safely Wednesday morning, marking another step forward towards the country's goal of building a permanent manned space station by 2020. The re-entry module of Shenzhou-10 landed safely on a sunlit prairie in North China's Inner Mongolia Autonomous Region at about 8.07 a.m. on Wednesday. All three astronauts were in good physical condition. Nia Haisheng, commander of the Shenzhou-10 crew and a second-time space traveller, was the first to emerge out of the bowl-like module, followed by Wang Yaping, the only female astronaut of the mission, and Zhang Xiaoguang. During a brief welcoming ceremony held at the landing area, the astronauts waved merrily to a crowd composed of military officers, the search and recovery team and health personnel. The Shenzhou-10 is China's first application-oriented space flight. Compared with its previous mission Shenzhou-9 last year, the Shenzhou-10 is no longer experimental, but considered an applicable shuttle system for transporting astronauts and supplies to orbiting modules. The mission aims to further test technologies designed for docking and supporting astronauts' stay in space, as well as to use new technologies related to the construction of a space station. A spokeswoman for China's manned space program told the press prior to the launch of the Shenzhou-10 spacecraft on June 11th. In its 15-day journey in space, Shenzhou-10 docked with the orbiting space lab Tiangong-1 twice, once through automatic operation and the other manual. The astronauts spent 12 days in Tiangong-1, where they conducted space medical experiments, technical tests and delivered a lecture to students on Earth about basic physics principles.